Okay. It's September 9th, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Reverend Lee, here once again with the Student of the Month of September, Makaya Johnson. She is the Student of the Month for Social Studies Department. Makaya, how does it feel to be Student of the Month out of your class? I mean, it's estimated to be over 250 students in your class. How does that feel to have this honor? Um, at first, I did not know that we were doing Student of the Month. So when the teacher told me, I was like, oh, that's really cool because there are a lot of people but I didn't think I would get it for social studies. That was a surprise. But thanks, Mr. Matt. I would, me personally, <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of jealous. I would love to get this award because I just love that so much. This is my, this is my personal favorite department, like the social studies to me. They have the favorite, <laughs> the best teachers. I mean, that's just my personal opinion. They do have but some best a junior, that's what you are. Yes. One year away from being a senior, it's a big deal. Uh, How do you feel about that? It's crazy because like it, everything is getting really serious like you have to like start looking at colleges more looking forward to scholarships make sure you have your credits it's just a lot more serious yes it's an intense time ladies and gentlemen yes, keep your head up during those times i mean you don't want to crack under that pressure this is a this is a great time to to uh show your intestinal fortitude Social studies, it has a lot of branches. It has history, economics, but the, the most important out of all those is politics. Are you interested personally in politics? Not really, but I like knowing a little bit about it, just like to get a foot in, but not really. Okay. I mean, it's not, it's not everybody's cup of tea. I mean, yeah. You, you said you knew a little bit about politics. I mean, I'm pretty sure you know about the candidates, yeah. Hillary and Mr. Trump. Uh, <laughs> Mr. Trump, I see, I see your reaction right yeah. there. If you had two minutes to talk to with the future president, what would you say to him? I would ask them what would they plan on doing now that they've actually won. I just ask them a lot of questions about how hard was it for them and stuff like that. Yeah, I mean, a little, a little spin-off question with them. What would you ask Mr. Trump? What would you ask him? <laughs> I don't, I don't know what I would ask him, um, probably.